All right, guys, so I literally just tried to try, ugh. I just tried to film this video, and I got up to show you my lashes, and my contact fell out. So I figured I'd start over. Hopefully a relatable moment. Do you guys ever just have those mornings where literally everything goes wrong in your, like, getting ready routine? So I took a shower, feeling optimistic, and then, like, I went to go do my makeup, and just everything... <laughs> Everything went wrong. Everything with my con like the con I forgot to put my contacts in. I had to put them in late. I was like, oh, I'm gonna wear my colored ones today. The colored one would like not stay in my eye. So then that just came out on camera, and I had to put in. Uh, this is first world problems, I know. But like, if just the liner was wrong. You know those days where everything goes wrong <laughs> for your makeup. <laughs> but enough about me. How are you, beautiful lady, man? You? <laughs> hey. So I hope you guys had an awesome December. I cannot believe it's over. I think I'm having such a hard time today because I haven't filmed a like a sit down video in close to a month because I just did vlogmas every day. So it was really hard to do like regular sit down videos too. So I'm back here doing those now. <laughs> But I did have my birthday a few days ago. Thank you everyone for the birthday wishes. That was awesome. And I hope you guys had a good Christmas or holiday. And I'm not going to include any of my gifts that I got for my birthday or Christmas in today's video. Um, because I'm going to do a whole separate video on that. Like you guys wanted like a big haul. Um, uh, yeah. So save. Stay tuned for that. So you should subscribe. Okay. <laughs> but anyway, let's just get into the favorites. I'm going to show you guys what I've been pretty much loving this month. Um, yes, okay. So first and foremost, from Victoria's Secret, they were having like some sort of sale, I think, where it was um, $20 reward card for every $75 you spend. So I decided to just get some online stuff. I got this pink crew neck in a bunch of colors because it's so comfy, cozy. It just says pink, pink on the front, pink, pink on the back. And um, I love maroon, and then it has this pink stripe on it. I did get a couple other colors, too. It's just been so cozy and comfy. I wear it, like, all the time when I'm just home relaxing. Um, I've been wearing that, like, all month. So that was, like, my favorite clothing item. My mom did get me this cardigan for my birthday. So I'll also show this and talk about it in the haul video. Um, another huge favorite this month. I was sick over the last... Like, a week or two, I got sick right before Alan and I went to New York for my birthday. And, uh, yeah, it was bad. So, Mucinex, Fast Max, Severe Congestion and Cough. This saved my life. Um, I had, no offense, <laughs> I know this word is gross. I had a lot of phlegm. Still kind of do a lot of phlegm and mucus. It's just nasty. Coughing, congestion. This helps amazingly. It takes, like, a day or two for it to work, but so helpful. Like, just so, so helpful. Okay. Next, uh, this was where I had a hard time on my last video. I wanted to talk about beauty favorites and I went up here to show my lashes and that's when my contact just fell out on camera. But anyway, I'm wearing really big lashes. My favorites, these are the Iconics from House of Lashes. I get compliments on these all the time where I go, where I go, wherever I go, because um, they're so like big and intense and I feel like they make my eyes look bigger because I have such teeny tiny eyes. So if you like these, give them a try. House of Lashes. I bought like a ton when they were on sale like a month ago. So I'm just going to keep going with the beauty favorites. On my lips, I have been wearing this lipstick color for so much this month. Just so much. It's Rodeo Drive from Gerard Cosmetics. It's really pretty. Um, I love the color. I just think it's like a really perfect everyday color. It kind of matches everything I feel like. So if I have a day where I'm like, I don't know what lipstick to wear, I put this on and I feel very content with it. So Rodeo Drive from Gerard Cosmetics. I do have a coupon code if you want to get some lipstick from them down in the description box. Oh, did you guys hear my phone, my Retail Me Not app, like cha-ching sometimes? That was funny timing. <laughs> I'm gonna keep going with other beauty favorites. So, okay, I bought this literally last week, but I have been using it like every day since. I don't know what my hair is doing. So everybody pretty much told me to try this, and as you guys know, I'm oily. I love a matte finish, so I picked up the Infallible from L'Oreal. Um, definitely the color is like probably one shade too dark. I am wearing it today, but I can make it work with a lighter powder. So this is the color 103 Natural Buff. Definitely should have got 102. I contemplated, I struggled, but I do really like it. I had a really long day yesterday. Um, I was closing at work and I had put my makeup on like 12 hours before, and it does say 24 hour wear. I don't think any makeup can really stay on looking like amazing for 24 hours, but after 12 hours, this was still looking pretty good, and that's amazing because. 
even the foundations I feel like that claim to be long lasting like they're long lasting but they're not like long lasting am i making sense here this one stayed on super super well it separated a little bit in certain spots but overall it was still really matte looked really good i'm very impressed with this um for like a good drugstore foundation if you like matte long lasting this one's really good and okay i have a couple other things i don't think i've mentioned these before i got this and i believe my boxy charm last month it's the tarte smolder eyes if we can see it, hello, hello, shalom. There we go, it looks like this, this is the color gold. Um, I don't like to put things in my waterline on my eyes because as I said, I feel like my eyes are teeny tiny. So I've been putting this on the bottom lash line just to give myself a little color and like make my eyes look more smoky without being like tiny. So I have this just like on the bottom lash line just to kind of give me a little something when I want my eyes to look a little more intense. And I love this, it's not too much, it blends out really well. It's just really pretty. And for a highlighter today, again the light's not great, hopefully you can kind of see my highlight. I have been using this City Color Cosmetics eyeshadow and it's in the color Skinny Latte. I hate the light that I'm in right now, but it's a really pretty color. You can use it as eyeshadow, but I just think it's the most beautiful highlight. Um, I'll put a little on my hand, hopefully you can kind of see it. Yeah, again, terrible lighting, but here you go. You can kind of see it there. I just think it's like the perfect highlight color. I have been obsessed with highlighting lately. This month, I've just been like a highlighting freak. I really want to try, there's a couple highlighters that everybody's been recommending, and I want to say they're from Becca, but I'm not sure. Comment and let me know your favorite highlighter so I know. <laughs> I'm dying. <laughs> Next, I have a couple of hair products that I've been using. Oh my gosh, guys, if you like hair masks, I got this one in, I think also from BoxyCharm. It's the Nelson J. Beverly Hills Moisture Healing Mask. This is the most amazing hair mask I've ever done. I immediately noticed a difference when I got out of the shower and brushed my hair and felt the, I just, I felt the difference. You're supposed to use it, <coughs> excuse me, once a week. Um, in your hair and it says seven f argan oil seven formula so it's supposed to detangle control your frizz prevent hair color fading seal your split ends protect from chlorine and salt water restore silkiness and shine and enhance your natural body and it's coconut scented which i love the smell of coconut and seriously guys it's so good and i have a lot of um you know <laughs> damage in my hair from getting it highlighted this makes it feel so soft and renewed and amazing um, I can blow dry it and it will just blow dry really beautifully and I feel like it still has a lot of shine. I used it this morning actually because um, my hair does, like I said, have a lot of damage and it just feels so amazing. If you guys got that in your box charm, use it. I use it once a week and I let it soak in for like five minutes. Oh, it's so good! And this month, I don't think I've ever used as much dry shampoo as I have because I was so busy. Um, I was kind of just letting my hair take a break. It's been good, though. I feel like my hair is getting pretty long, which is really weird for me because my hair is usually feels short. But um, I've been letting it kind of just rest, trying not to dry it out. So I've been using a lot of dry shampoo. So this month, I used one that I got... I don't know where I got it from. I definitely didn't buy it because I haven't seen it before. It's from Chlorine, and it's the dry shampoo with oat milk. It's the gentle formula. It looks like this. I have no idea. I use it and I really like it. I feel like it works really well. I'm kind of snobby when it comes to dry shampoo, but I have found a few that I really like and this happens to be one of them. So I used that like all month long. It was a definite favorite. Um, the next thing is, oh my gosh. Do you ever just watch like an eyeliner roll off your makeup desk and you're like, bye Felicia, see you later. <laughs> this is from Sprinkle of Glitter. I bought this in London when I was there a few months ago. Um, I think they sell them here too, but Louise from Spl Sprinkle of Glitter on YouTube, she made this diary for 2016 and it's to have the best year of your life and it's the cutest thing ever. I'm going to use it as a planner slash diary. Um, and I think it's just special because it reminds me of London when I look at it because that's where I bought it. So I just adore her. So she has really, she has planner on one side and then she has really inspirational and cute things on the other side. So like here is a motivational quote, um, like happy birthday, here's all the signs. It just is really sweet, like tips for a happy life, like recipes, like an 
autumn is coming. It's just, uh, it's just really sweet. And it just is so helpful. Like tips to make your perfect Christmas shopping day. I don't know, depending on like the day and the week and the season, it just has something to make your life a little more special. And I'm all about finding little things to make, you know, everything a little more special. It's all about the little things for me. And this is just gonna make it a really special 2016. So I'm really excited about that. I know it's like not really a monthly favorite because it's for next year, but you know. You feel me, girl. Okay. As always, yo girl gotta talk about food. So this is my jam. Oh my god. Oh my god. Can we stop texting me? Stop texting me. <laughs> so I got these from Target. Um, Target. Mark and I discovered them last year. We did like a Christmas taste test. These are so good. If you haven't tried from Lay's the chocolate covered potato chips, you have to try them. The milk chocolate's my favorite, but we also like dark. Um, Alan loves dark chocolate, so we got these. They're so delicious. I die. I die. Get them before the holiday season is over because they still have them, I think, right now. So delicious. Um, and I have a couple more favorites, I believe. Alan did get me these for my birthday, but I just wanted to show them. I love Ferrero Rocher. So he got me, like, this Christmas pack. It has, like, dark chocolate, regular, and coconut. Oh, so good, so good. Um, I know I just got them, and I wasn't supposed to show them, but I will. And then I wanted to show my favorite pair of shoes at the moment, these cute little booties. They're my mom's, but I borrow them. When I have a long shift at work and I'm standing on my feet all day, I cannot tell you the amount of shoes that I have bought, the amount of shoes that I've tried. They're super cute. They have like a suede velvety panel back here. They have zippers on both sides. I think they're adorable. They're the only shoes that don't hurt my feet after a long shift. They're incredible shoes. Oh, I want to show you guys my birthday flowers. They're still going strong. Alan gave these to me the day before my birthday, and they're still so beautiful, like five days later. Look how pretty. Ah, I love flowers. Oh, so pretty. What a sweet little nugget. Anyway, um, so that's going to do it for my monthly favorites. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed it. Again, I will have my birthday and Christmas haul coming very soon as well. Um, I don't, it's not like braggy. You guys want me to just show you guys what I got because my birthday and Christmas fall together. And I guess that's all. I can't believe it's almost 2016. I have a lot of fun stuff coming up. What do you guys want to see in 2016? Comment and let me know because... We're all in this together. Hashtag High School Musical. Okay? Hi. Thank you to all the new subscribers who are about to follow me in 2016 and all my loyal, fearless tribers. I love you guys so, so, so much. We're going to have an awesome year. I'm here for you. Um, I have all my social media linked down below if you want to follow me there for more adventures. And I love you so much, and I'll see you soon. Bye.